Whoa, 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 whoa. What? What? Hey there, welcome back to the channel. I'm Sean Jay. I'm a professional magician, speaker, and 3D designer. Most of my time is spent performing on stages and at private parties and events, but I thought I'd do something a little different for you here on the channel. Uh, I'm gonna be reacting to some of the worst epic magic fails, magic tricks for people attempting to do magic tricks, and we'll see how this goes. So uh, if you wanna see more content like this, be sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, turn the notification bell on, how to stay up to date when I release more episodes. So with all that being said, let's jump right into it. This guy's like a street performer. Swallowing stuff in front of kids, never a good idea. I know people that can do this for real. That chick was like, yeah, that's what I thought was happening. That reminds me of the uh, the lightsabers, you know, those toy lightsabers where you go, where you give it a flick and it extends out like that and you push it back. The Force Unleashed lightsaber. The only lightsaber that lets you unleash both sides of the Force. And you push it back. Comment down below if you had one of those when you were little or maybe you have kids and uh, you have a kid that has one of these. Ah, oh, man, if you're going to do it, either do it as a genuine gag, but don't like try to pull, p pass it off as real, and then... And then now he's begging for applause. Ah, supernaturalists. Yeah, 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 this is uh, Spencer. I met him a few years ago. Seems to be a really cool guy, and he likes to do escapes. And just to let you know, most of the escape style magic stuff, it's actually real, very real danger involved. And if you screw it up, you could get injured or die. Escape artist Spencer Horseman attempted Houdini's water cell trick in front of a live audience broadcast by ABC. But about midway through the performance, Dang. Out, requiring immediate medical attention, failing his escape. Are you okay? Are you okay? I, I feel fine. Dude, you don't look fine. That's what you look like now, and that's what you look like before. Totally fine there, but definitely not there. Uh, this is why I don't do escapes. Poor guy. He's a cool guy. He's a really cool guy. Why? Why is the guy not wearing a shirt? Why is he wearing swimming trunks? And there's just so many. The, uh, yeah, there's a lot of fails simultaneously happening that my brain is kind of like frazzled. This, this thing over here, um, my editor didn't know this, but this is actually a gag item. But it's very convincing. Uh, the shat. This thing didn't really go up there. Um, it just gives the illusion that it does. But judging by the reaction, the audience uh, totally bought it, hook, line, and sinker. The cutest fail on this list goes to a super perceptive boy named Murray, to whom the magician David Williamson tries to show a card trick. David Williamson's awesome, by the way. This probably, please don't judge him by this. He's really fantastic. He's hilarious. It just happened to be a bad day for him, I guess. He picked the wrong uh, magic trick material choice for a very perceptive child and most people don't know that children are the hardest audience to perform for extremely difficult because they are brutally honest they cut right to the chase live tv williamson places three cards face up in front of him but murray immediately notices an additional card stuck to one of them ruining the trick now watch very closely we have three cards <laughs> Williamson is shocked that Murray has so quickly spoiled the illusion and sends him off. Goodbye. And what's your eyes? I will demonstrate for you my abilities. 
classic. Okay, if you're going to attempt levitation, no body shaming here, but at least just try to get yourself in shape just a little bit so your props can handle the extra 75 to 100 pounds that shouldn't be there. Whoa, this, wait a second. Is this, this is like 50 shades of acrobatic. Uh, Definitely interesting. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? What? Okay, thank God she's okay. She's got um, extra protective gear on her head. That helps out a whole lot, okay. Good, I'm glad she's okay. She could have broken her neck though, and that is not funny. Howie rubbing his head for good luck. Meanwhile, somewhere in rural China, some kid opens a door to their hut. Oh, he closed the door. Sure, he said uh, some words in Chinese. If you know Chinese and you know what he said, go ahead comment down below. I don't, but uh, I'm sure he said a few things that I can't repeat for a uh, family audience. So that's part one, short, sweet, to the point. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Go ahead, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell if you want to see more content like this. I might do a part two into this kind of thing. So uh, yeah, that's all for now, and we'll see you in the next video.